I never did a follow-up video regarding Roberto Duran and him contracting COVID-19, so I feel it's appropriate that I do. Rather than just saying that Manos de Piedra contracted COVID-19, I feel it's more important to state that he has beaten this disease, which has done a doozy on 2020. He gave a statement after, well, while he was in the process of leaving the hospital. And I will never tire of thanking all the doctors, nurses who gave their best every day, regardless of the risk they take. I may be a former world champion, but you are the true champions of life. I care for you all. Please stay in the house. Follow the quarantine and under no circumstances let anyone <laughs> enter your house. Stone hands. Classic. There's a, a little video there. You can see a little thumbnail of it. Of Manus de Piedra leaving the hospital with uh, the nurses and that wa waving Panamanian flags. Classic. I don't think we ever really doubted Roberto Duran to be up COVID-19 considering the people who he has beaten before in his life. The only member of the Fabulous Four to beat Sugar Ray Leonard, of course. The small little five foot seven former lightweight who went on to outpoint the massive middleweight Iron the Blade Barkley as a 37 year old. I mean, we are talking some pound for pound greatness here. It's great to hear positive message same age as my dad almost 70 roberto duran and whoops the ass of covid19 i hope that can provide a bit of inspiration for anybody else who may be affected by this virus and let's give a little salute to hands of stone